Hello Libra, I'm Susie from The Gift 202 and I'm here to read your cards for the week of the 23rd of May. So Angel, Spirit, Bird, Universe, what would you like Libra to know about the week of the 23rd of May? Please like, share and subscribe if you haven't already. Angel, Spirit, Guide, Universe, for Libra, for the week of the 23rd of May. What would you like Libra to know about the week of the 23rd of May for Libra, Libra? Oh, that's a lot of cards. Take these four first. One, two, three, four. Oh, Libra. Oh. Five of Pentacles is on the bottom of the deck. Watch your money. Pay off what you need to pay off. Don't leave yourself without. This is like credit cards and things like that. Don't leave yourself without even energy. Don't put the gas mask on first. And then for other people. First card is Six of Swords with the High Priestess. Your intuition, your instincts, everything about your dreams um, are. Your gut instinct is so on point, right? Because this is your gut as well, like your literal gut. It could be something to do with the belly. <laughs> but um, it's going to a more peaceful time. You, do, you know, you don't want rumbling in your belly or anything like that, or your gut feelings like telling you to maybe just sort something out there's something there's something instinctual you're going to have a dream about something it could be a lotto win it could be an inheritance there's money coming um there's money here you might have just got this money uh or a, a, a stable family or feeling secure okay there's security you might be a tarot reader or something like that, but there's there's something secure being offered here from a Knight of Pentacles, but you don't trust it. There's two people here. There's two knights. Oh my gosh, there's two knights and an emperor. Libra, what are you doing? Okay, so basically, you're feeling, your instincts are on point. There's an angel on your shoulder protecting you. There's something secure, it's family, it's, you, you feel quite good at the moment. You might have won something. This knight who's too slow in coming forward has made you very jealous and not um, confused. You're indecisive about two people, right? They're both coming, one is coming towards you, this knight of cups, to offer you this love, okay? It's a date of love. Um, but you're confused still. You're jealous and you don't can't make up your mind about what to do. I would say there's an emperor here, which is a boss, a leader, an Aries. Um, going to ask you on a date to a party, or it could be a, a dad's party or something like that with lots of women, lots of fun, a date. There's something of a lovely date being offered. And don't forget, you stick by your gut instincts. You know, you've gone to be peaceful to get sort of get in touch with your spiritual self. Um, maybe you're coming back as a different person. Um, and you're planning like this Knight of Pentacles to make a decision. It, you know, you need to look at the Two of Cups that are standing. Someone's about to offer you some romance and this Aries or this Emperor is here. Um, could be you'd meet them at a party. They want to take, they own things. They're, they're grounded. The number four would be significant. There's something very fair going to happen. You're no longer a pawn in a game. The type, justice is on your side. You're going to have a, um, there might be a family tax rebate or something like that. Or your friends are very fair. You could be dealing, like your element is here. The fairness, the justness, the the legal situation, no longer a pawn in the game. Maybe you felt like you were a bit of a, a third party, but the wheel's turning in your favour. This is fated. There's something fair. There's something legal. Could be a marriage. Something turning in your favour legally so that you can have fun. You could be dealing with a Sagittarius. We've got the three knights here. <laughs> Someone's coming in passionate. Someone is coming in passionate because it's a twin flame partnership.
you like this person, they like you, you have very lots of similarities. Um, you want to have fun with this person. You just want to go and have fun. That's it. You stick of <sighs> now that the justice is out of the way, or the marriage, or the divorce is over, or there's, uh, you know, there's you feel secure, or you've got this rebate, or there's some kind of now things are starting to turn solidly, fairly balanced, um, truthfully in your favour. This per this person flies in for some fun now they could be the emperor just as another just as representing young and, and dumb <laughs> they've got a vice they've you know they they could be someone you knew from beyond but back in the day but there's lots of um You'll know what to do because you'll have a dream about this person. This could be a birthday party. Uh, like your dad throws you a birthday party or something and then you're of legal age or something like that. There's something very happy, very joyful about this week and it's someone's rushing in. You might not see them yet to offer you this love and they feel that it's time the time is now they can't wait any longer angel spirit guides universe for libra please angel spirit guides you the universe for libra what would you like libra gosh i can't take all of those what would you like libra to know about this week of the 23rd of may for libra please just three cards please angels just three cards. Now, this just fell out. Children, your love life is being affected by children. Angels, spirit guides, universe. What would you like Libra to know about this week of the 23rd? Just two more, please, for Libra. Two more for Libra for the week of the 23rd of May. Two more for Libra for the week of the 23rd of May. Passion. Allow your heart and soul to sing with joy. See, you allow yourself to have this, this fun at the end of the week. Finances and career. Financial issues are a factor in your love life right now. So maybe there's something to do with an inheritance about family and children. Um, you know, you take the high road with that high priestess. She holds the secrets. You've got a lot of knowledge about things. Um, there could be a confusion between brothers and a father um but ultimately when this is all sorted out it's time to go and have fun at the end of the week <laughs> unfortunately there is that five of pentacles there but there's the sun underneath it that i can see so don't leave yourself without do you know what i mean don't money we have wise don't give it to these people and then leave yourself without so you can't go on this fantastic date let's ask the angels spirit guides universe for libra Libra, please. It's like you were sorting something out justifiably, like with justice, and it was timing, and it's the time, you know, with you might have been in a on a court case or something, and you couldn't go and see this twin flame because you're on this uh, uh, you had to be do uh what's it, jury service or something like that. Angel spirit guides to spend time alone in nature meditating about your desires and intentions ask the angels to help you gain a positive perspective so it's this going away to spend some time and maybe you've spent this time sort of contemplating and spiritually asking your source what shall i do angels spirit guides universe what should Libra do this week what are the angels going to tell it too many too many too many too many Angels, spirit guides, what would you like Libra to know about this week of the 23rd of May? Two more cards, please. There you go. One more card. Your emotions are healing, which enables you to open to greater love. I will help you release anger and unforgiveness from your heart and mind. Angels, spirit guides, patience. Yep. Yeah. Your dreams are blooming more rapidly than you realise. Still, they need nurturing and patience. So it's this patient card. It's going away somewhere. To contemplate what to do because you're indecisive. So be patient. There's something coming. Oh, too many. Too many. I'll take the one that's face down. 
Now is the time to learn, study and gather information. Enjoy being a student because in the future you will, you will synthesise your knowledge into action. There's knowledge in this justice as well. And it's fated. Something happens at a party that's justified, fated and allows you to have this knight of wands come in, fly in. He's very charming and they're very fun. But I think it's this is the beginnings of a new love. This is the beginnings of seeing eye to eye with somebody. And um, it's to have a little bit of fun, I think, after you, all this contemplating and shh, these people. Then <laughs> Anyway, passion, children, finances and career. Allow your heart to sing with joy. Your love life is, is being affected by children and finances and career. Maybe you have to pay off these kids first before you can go and have a, have a good time. Anyway. <laughs> I'm the gift Susie, and if you want to read them with me, it's the gift cs at gmail.com. Um, no, it's the gift to a 2cs at gmail.com. Please like, share, and subscribe, and I will speak to you soon. Bye bye, Libra.